for today's Mushroom Monday. We have another wintry decomposer. And that is Daldinia concentrica, King Alfred's Cakes. King Alfred's Cakes, the common name, comes from a legend about King Alfred who was hiding out in the countryside and he was in a farm and the owner of the house said, I'm going out for a minute, would you mind keeping your eye on some cakes I've just put in the oven? As you can see, he didn't do a good job. He left the cakes in the oven and this is their fate. They, uh, they ended up very burned. Another name for them though in English is coal fungus. Coal fungus because A, it looks quite a lot like a lump of coal and B, because you can use it as a fire lighter. And it's nice because on this pile of wood here, you can see it in its younger phase here, where it's a more muddy brown sort of a colour. And as it gets older and matures, it goes really coal black. That's because the spores are all black and if you leave it accidentally on your kitchen surface, you'll come back to a nasty mess of black spores everywhere. And if we slice it open, we can see that inside it's got these amazing concentric rings, almost like on a tree, which can tell us about the age and the growth of the mushroom. So let's take one home and dry it out, see what happens. It's really important to dehydrate the mushroom completely in order for this to work. When I weighed it in the evening, it was 36 grams, and in the morning after dehydrating, it was only six grams in weight. So that's an important first step. But then, as you can see, literally just one spark from a flint will stick and smolder, and then you've got yourself a fire lighter.